Hey babe, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to do a different type of video and I'm super stoked for it. We are going to be styling pointed toe shoes. These have been taking off in trendiness lately. A lot of looks have a really cute pointed toe aesthetic to go with them. So what I did today from Fashion Nova was pulled together a bunch of different cute shoes and put together a look for them. Mostly we've got dresses and just like some cute little, I'm trying to get into my feminine side. So that's kind of what we're looking at today. But yeah, I am super stoked. So. Let's get right into the clothes. But first things first, give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and turn on your post notifications so that you can see when I'm posting next. And make sure you check out Fashion Nova if you are looking for some new cute pointed toe shoes and outfits to go with them, all of it. All right, let's get right into it. So the first shoes I'm going to show to you are these super cute little pointed toe mesh shoes. They have little polka dots. They are freaking adorable. They also have a little bit more support to them than they look like because the side is a clear see-through side, which is fantastic. And they're just a short little heel. So perfect for events. They've got some padding. So great for wearing longer term. And I'm super excited to put these with an outfit. What I have picked for these, like I said, we are trying to go a little bit more feminine, cutesy. So this dress has the same sort of mesh style to it, which is really cute. And it's got a double layer, obviously. You have to with the mesh dresses. It's a midi dress. So you've got that mid-length look. So the shoes still can stand out. And then you have got the rouging along the bust, which just a little something extra. This style has been in a ton lately as well. It's super feminine, super flirty, super aesthetic. It's almost giving that like sort of same as that corset bust feel that's going around lately, but it's absolutely stunning. So that is our first look and the shoes to match. Next up. All right, next up, I'm gonna show you these ones. These might just be my favorite ones that I got in this haul. We have some super cute tie up white shoes. These ones have a little bit of a snakeskin print, so they give a little bit of like sexy while still being cutesy with all those little bows. I like the higher ankle to them and that they have that sort of open look with them, but I just think that these are stunning and a very feminine kind of mixed sort of style, which works for me. Now, these being as cute and simple as they are, but they've got a little bit of extra to them, extra height added to them. We had to pair these with a short dress. So staying with that feminine feel, we have an adorable little tulle dress. This isn't a skirt, it is a dress. It's got the ribbing in the top, the boning. So it is nice for like sucking everything in, making you look extra snatched. It's got some great detail on the top there. There's a ton of little beads. Um, Yeah, beautiful beading. But yes, I love, love, love lace or tulle skirts. And I think that just looking at them with the shoes, they are just so stunning together that I can't wait to wear this out and have it be like a little bit of a showstopper moment. like. That's what I'm getting from this. Alrighty, on to the next one. Okay, let's go a completely different direction here. Well, I lied, we're not going a different direction. I really wanna look at these shoes. So this is where we're at. <gasps> oh, I love them. Okay, these are a really good pump. I love the satiny aesthetic. I love that it has a little bow. It makes it a little bit more feminine. And I love that it's just like a simple pointed toe shoe. It's just so simple. Simplicity is key with a lot of outfits. And I think that this will really shine, allow the outfit to shine through, but still gives a little pop of something extra. So it still looks super cute. Yes, I love them. I love them. These can go with so many different styles. Like you could throw these on with jeans and a crop top. I could literally put these on with the outfit that I'm currently wearing and make it look just elevated. I think that's the big thing about like this pointed toe style. The aesthetic that's coming in is that it really just like elevates things in a kind of simple way. So the dress I have for this is a maxi dress. It goes all the way down, but not cool. It's not supposed to go quite to the angles, but that depends on my height versus the dress. <laughs> so, oh. It comes with undies. It must be a little sheer. It is a little sheer. That's okay. Oh, no, no, no. It's not because it's sheer. It's because of the sides. Ah, I see. Okay, so this is super cute. This is a little bit more on like the sexy cutesy side. It still has some lace, so it still gives that feminine vibe to it. It's got the little lace ups, which make it a little bit more of that sexy vibe, that little, little bit more sultry, if you will. And then it's a tighter bottom. It's not like a big flowy skirt. It's just like very form fitted and very just like sleek. So that's why I thought that this was perfect for those shoes. Again, having the ties and having the bows they kind of match together so i feel like this is like a perfect combination oh i'm so excited this is so stunning i'm obsessed i'm always obsessed let's be honest i get so excited about new clothes 
Okay, let's go a little bit more. Okay, we're gonna go a little bit more on the casual side. So these shoes, fairly simple open-toed shoes. Open-toed shoes, the pointed toe still just gives them just a little bit more, what's the word that I'm thinking for? Just elegance, almost, you know? Like something flat-toed, those have super been super trendy as well, but the pointed toe just is a little bit more elegant. These ones are cute because they go up your ankle a little bit, so a bit of a higher outfit. They still give you a little bit of something extra with them. So what I put with these is something a little bit more, wow, that was a lot of littles. Something a bit more day-to-day, -day, like a little bit more vacation-y, a little bit more like comfy. So we have this. I hope they called it actually. Let me go look because I want to I want to tell you the proper. Oh, wait, hold on a minute. Caftan maxi dress. It says it right on here. It's a wild thing. Satin caftan, caftan, caftan maxi dress. So here, this one, I definitely got in a size small. I usually wear a size medium just because I knew it would be oversized, but it's super cute and it goes, it's a maxi, but it goes pretty much just ankle height. So it still leaves a little bit of space for the shoes to kind of have their moment. And again, just like a super nice casual outfit. So can be worn for vacation, maybe like even a night out on a vacation. I would totally take this for a beach vacation. I think it's stunning. And yeah, a little bit more of a casual outfit. Alrighty, next up. We have got, ooh, which one do I want to do? Should I go more casual? Yeah, let's go a little bit more casual. What we have got here, oh, these are cuter in person than I thought they would be, is these cute little buttoned, open-toed, pointed-toed heels. They are, again, a shorter heel, which is nice for if you have a long night ahead of you, and especially with the open heel you need something that's not going to have you falling all over and like bambi so these are really cute they're very very uh casual looking but they really are going to elevate a casual look which is kind of why i love them so there we go a super cute casual open toe look now with these i've gone very casual with the outfit we have got a pair of cute jeans because you can still wear heels with jeans and it elevates the look it just does so these ones have a few rips and are folded at the end. They're a little bit more of your sort of summer nights, comfy, cozy kind of look. They've got some stretch. I love, love, love Fashion Nova jeans because they fit nice and they always have a little bit of stretch. So they really do fit even though you're buying them online. So as long as you stay true to your size, then you'll you'll be good. But yeah, these are a little bit more of like that ankle height so that you can still see them as well. See the shoes, I mean, as well. And then to go with that, I went for something a little bit different. I went like super casual just to put the this look together. This is also kind of a vacation style piece. It's a double tie kind of kimono vibe, but I love it. I will personally wear it with just like a little crop top underneath. Um, probably more like a bra top style crop, but yeah, double tie. It flows down, so it kind of like leads into the shoes, which gives it a little bit of something extra. And yeah, it's just stunning, stunning pieces. I like this. This is like the Illuminati vibe, and I love that vibe. Love that style. Big fan, big fan. Okay, I'm saving the best shoes for last, just so you know. These are similar to the other ones. They're the same sort of polka dot style, but they're a white with a black polka dot. So they do really make things look a bit different because of that, or make the, the whole look a bit different because of that. And it makes them a cute, very feminine kind of style for that reason. But yeah, I love these. I think these are gonna be a good everyday kind of pump that you can wear with work stuff, with casual. It's a good little mix. Again, I love that it has the sh clear sides because it helps to kind of encompass your foot in it's a little bit more support and then you guys the look to go with this we're going for the work work look so this is a less casual look oh i'm excited this is called the always sophisticated tuxedo blazer pant set this is the she's a boss babe vibe so all white set trousers the open leg trousers they're not wide leg they're just like a straight leg well they're a little bit wide leg but the white trousers, super cute. Gotta be careful what underwear you're wearing underneath. And then the white blazer top. Oh, I love it. And then we can still have, we have the satin and then still a moment for the shoes um, because they will stand out against all the white. So love, 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 love. I wonder how many more times I can say love. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. They're all so different, but in such a good way. Okay, like I said, I was saving the best for last in terms of shoes. So here, oh. We have these lovely little bedazzled pointed toe heels. They are a little bit higher and they have the crisscross back. And as you can see, aren't actually open toe. They have a bit of a secure point. So it does actually keep your foot in shape, which is good. But yeah, how stunning are these? I was so excited to get these. I thought they were gonna be gorgeous and they are. Wow, my hair is wild today. So sorry guys. Yeah, they are. Just as I had imagined. There we go. 
except that I can't get them apart. That's a me problem though, not a shoe problem. Okay, I'll deal with that later. But to go with these, I have a different type of kind of fancy dress. So I went with one that's cream just to kind of pull together the look being silver, not white. I wanted to bring in a dress that was a little off white. Again, like I said, I'm going for the more feminine looks. So this is a little bit of a feminine short dress. It's a very lacy. It's got the pearls, which I think goes nicely with the bedazzle. So that's kind of what that was, is a very cute summer dress and summer style where together they just look gorgeous. And because it's a short dress, you have the moment for the shoes and the shoes are able to stand out and you can definitely see them because these things are blinging from a mile away. So yeah, gorgeous. I'm obsessed. I'm so excited. I love it. I love it. Whew. The hair is herring today. That is all I have got for you for the pointed toe shoe try on haul. Let me know what you recommend for pointed toe styles. If you have any that you absolutely love, I would love to see them, love to hear about them and would love to try them. So let me know in the comments down below. Let me know which outfits you liked the best and what you think went really well together. Other than that, that's all I've got for you today. Thank you to Fashion Nova for all of these wonderful clothes for this video. It would not have been possible without them. And that is all. That's it. That's all. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and turn on the post notifications so that you can see when I'm posting next. And hopefully we can do this again soon. Ooh, or if there's other shoe styles that you want me to try, let me know. Let me know in the comments down below. But that's that. I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching. Smash that like and I'll see you in the next video.